Hey uglies and stinkies, for this video I will be explaining how to farm for the shark kitty creature Mirlark. The Mirlark will be a new addition to the boosted gacha. The tasks to get a boosted gacha token are, grow 10 different boosted creatures to adulthood, complete all missions and claim rewards from 50 region missions as a boosted creature, travel 35,000 studs on land, travel 35,000 studs by swimming and travel 35,000 studs by flying. For those who don't know what a boosted creature is, there are four different types of boosts that can apply to creatures and can boost a creature's various stats, growth rate, chance of obtaining glimmer, and exchange rate of selling species for tickets. These boosts are randomly assigned to any creature every 12 hours and are indicated with a little symbol that appears on the View Creatures section on the top right of individual creature icon boxes in the creature inventory. These randomly assigned boosts were implemented with the intent and added bonus effect of encouraging players to play a greater variety of creatures. Region missions are heavily tied with each biome, acting as a set. Once a task set is completed, there's a 5-minute cooldown until you can complete those same missions on the same biome again. The land biomes are Central, Rock Faces, Desert, Flower Cove, Jungle, Mesa, Mountains, Pride Rocks, Redwoods, Swamp Hill, Tundra and Volcano Island. The missions for the land biomes are Eat or Drink 50 Units of Food or Water, Roll in Mud 3 times, Attack or Heal another player 5 times, sniff out food five times, drink 50 units of water, survive for 150 seconds and travel 1,000 studs in this region. The underwater biomes are algae sandbar, coral reef, grassy shoal, rocky drop and seaweed depths. The missions for the underwater biomes are eat or drink 50 units of food or water, attack or heal another player five times, survive for 150 seconds, sniff out food five times and travel 1,000 studs in this region.